Let's get into this video. So I wanted to do a spin on the Amazon hauls or like my favorite this month hauls because we are all collectively in this time together where we are stuck in our houses. We're trying to figure out the best ways to limit our time outside. And so I have a few items to make your life at home easier in terms of organizing, in terms of being efficient and just just to make your life easier. If you haven't been to this page before, please like, comment, and subscribe to my channel. I make videos kind of from a military wife perspective, but basically overall lifestyle vlogs and informational tips on life and also for military wives. So let's get right into it. My favorites for laundry have been these little bins from Amazon. I love them so much. They make my life easier when I step into my closet, put my dirty clothes in one of these things. It just makes me so happy. The seller has a bunch of different kinds. You'll see in the link. The one I got is this like geo print. It's black and it's like kind of a eggshell white. This is the gray one. This is mine. <laughs> if you can't tell, they are kind of dingy because I have been using them since I got them. So I love our Brita filter. It is so helpful. Oops, sorry guys. It literally makes getting water so much easier. I don't have to worry about going to the store for water and it might not being there. I can definitely taste the difference at, between the tap water and putting it through the Brita filter. We've had this for about... I wanna say a year now, and it has worked perfectly throughout that time. It helps you remember to always, always have water on you during these times. You wanna make sure you're drinking and staying hydrated. If you are worried about maybe like I am, about your grandparents not being able to get groceries or just them being out in the world at this time, offer to get them a Brita filter or that they invest in one themselves. I don't know, it just makes my life a little bit uh, better when I know that everyone's cool and safe and this will definitely help out when it comes to water. While we're on the water trend, I got this Takaya water bottle. If you can see, it's so probably not gonna focus when I want it to, of course, but it's my favorite thing. <laughs> Everything is my favorite, okay. I think, it is dishwasher safe. I actually haven't put it through the dishwasher. I just use like sponges specifically for bottles and I just put it through here and clean as often as I need to. It has a spout, which I really prefer. And a little way for you to just grab the spout so you're not actually touching the part that you put your mouth on. And it comes also with a detachable bottom so that you don't mess up your tables. And it also says the website on the back. So it is takayausa.com, but I got it from Amazon. It's metal. And if you go to the gym, it's really easy to carry with you. And I know sometimes when I realize in the gym that this is kind of hard to put in the little slot for your water. So I just take off the bottom and put it next to it. It's no big deal. It's perfect. And I love Takaya products. I actually had a hot cup before and that's why I really knew I liked this brand because it kept my stuff so hot. It kept my stuff so cold for hours. I would leave work and there would still be like a couple ice cubes in my iced coffee. So I knew this brand was really good. And let me just show you the inside. It does have like a little straw and I believe this specific design is patented. It's specifically a Takaya product or a Takaya. You get the gist. I love it and it's in my favorite powder pink. They have a bunch of different colors. You'll see when you click the link below. So the next item I'm gonna show you guys is something that I do also take with me on my walks. It is my Sweet Sweat Band and I love it so much. This is not sponsored. This is a, uh, I love this product enough to tell you guys about it. Endorsed by Alexandria J. You can um, fit it under your shirt and it doesn't like bulk out, which I love. You can't see the straps or like the band under your shirt at all. I see so much results even if I take a walk. I am walking on like a dirt path when I do take my walk, so it's a little bit strenuous, but I take this off when I get home and it's like full of sweat. It's really, really good. So I did tell you guys I was gonna be showing you some more organizational stuff. So this is another thing that I got from Amazon. It is awesome. This is my new jewelry box and as you can tell it has like a little snake skin texture to it and design it is really really good quality I must say I was surprised the detailing wasn't as wasn't thoroughly demonstrated on Amazon through the pictures for it in person I was like wow I don't even remember buying this <laughs> I remember it being something a little bit different I'm so happy that it's not so it does have a clasp here for you to open it and I'll try to open it right now And this is it. I don't have much jewelry, but I am tired of like fishing for jewelry. I had it all in a little pouch at first. 
So I'm really glad I have this. I took the necklaces out so I can easily show you guys without them coming out when I opened it. And I put necklaces here as well. I have my watches here and another necklace here that's a little bit longer for this. Earrings go here. I put my smaller earrings, my studs, and like my smaller hoops in here as well and like I have these humongous hoops here that I put with the necklaces pouch. On the inside it is like this suede material and it is pink which is a constant in my house. So the bottom layer which is the last layer I have my larger earrings and dangly earrings. I probably might put some bracelets in here. The other layer has a little compartment for bracelets but it's not as big. But yes this was a great Amazon find. I wanted something for my jewelry and this worked out perfectly. So I may be late with this item but I completely love it and if you can have this in your cart for later so that you just hold the brand I highly recommend you do that. It is my planner and I love her. She is for 2020. She is new. She is great. Well, not new, but it was all a lie. Guys, it was all a lie. <laughs> We're only in April, y'all. And I would not be ashamed of you if you got your planner right now. I'm not ashamed. Get your planner. It is not too late. It is never too late. It is made by Global Printed Products. When you open it, it has the months of the year and it does go through December. It has the tabs for each month so you can just easily go to the month and before each month you have another calendar and you also have a little note section in the next months as well to give you a look a preview of what you're heading towards. After the month page you do have your normal little section for agenda setting. The back cover does have 2021 right here listed out for you. And I think it's a little clever for them to do that because they're like, all right, next year, have your freaking journal ready to order. Bonus tip, you do have planning stickers guide. These ones say to do up here. They have money signs because we are in our bag this year and the next. And then you have like these cool, cute little checks for once you check off things, arrow marks. It is so cool to have stuff like this. In the back pocket, it does have post-its for you. And it's like these cute little ones at work. I would see these for like where to put your signature. So I love these, they're so cute. And then they also have the normal little post-its for you as well. As you can see, it also has a cute little tab. It's the same print as the cover of the notebook and it says today at the top. I am a little reckless, so I did somehow mess this up, but it's awesome. Also, it'd be a good idea to use that as like a bookmark. I always forget to buy bookmarks. Which brings us right to our next and final haul or idea for quarantine to keep you sane. And that is books. We love books, guys. My house is full of books. Oh no. All right, so I have three books here and I haven't read them. We did read this one. It's called Zero to One Notes on Startups or How to Build the Future. Peter Thiel is actually the starter of PayPal and was its CEO and led it public. He's also an investor who invested in LinkedIn, Yelp, and Airbnb and other companies as well, but those are ones that I can think of off the top of my head. The next is Dale Carnegie's How to Win Friends and Influence People in the Digital Age. I have not read this book yet, but it comes highly recommended, so I can't to start it. And this one I am currently in the middle of. It is called The 4 Hour Work Week by Timothy Ferris. It also comes highly recommended from certain people that I follow on Instagram who read this book and they have said like they love it and it's a really valuable read. I might do another little book haul for you guys because I do have a bunch of books that I did buy in anticipation of just being at home for a little bit. Let you guys in on those soon. So that ends my video for today. I hope you guys enjoyed. Please let me know in the comments if there are any other products you find helpful during this time or just recommend to other people watching this video. We definitely appreciate all of your ideas and please like this video. Please subscribe to my channel. I'm a little baby channel but I have some information that I want to give out to you guys so please please keep updated with me. Till next time guys. Bye. I'm out of breath. And in this, in, in this year, oh, oh, oh. hmm. Hello guys and welcome to, if you have not heard of me before, I am Alexandria. <laughs> no, you've never heard of me before. That works.